Hello YouTubers and welcome to my first Louis Vuitton review. This is the Louis Vuitton pocket organizer in the monogram canvas. As you can see, that's a box there and I'll show you the receipt. As you can see, it says Louis Vuitton. There, the LV. And there's the receipt on George Street on February the 16th, 2018. As you can see, 400 in Australia. Put that aside. Uh, this is the box, very well nice, very nice. And let's have a look at the organizer. So as you can see, um, I redid the ribbon on this because I've actually been using it, but I wanted to do a little unboxing. So I'll put the ribbon back on, but yeah, it looks lovely. Okay, so let's get into it. the ribbon. Okay, now Louis Vuitton. Are we ready? I love this moment. <laughs> As you can see, is a see Louis Vuitton is the dust bag. Dust bag there. And let's have a look at the beautiful monogram pocket organizer. As you can see there it is in the monogram canvas. There's the card there. Coated fabric cowhide leather lining, Louis Vuitton. As you can see, and we've got our black Louis Vuitton. This one's made in France. Very nice. A very nice addition to my collection. Very nice. Now, I want to show you how the cards go into here. So, um, this one has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven eight, nine slots. And I'll show you how that works. So here's my opal card. So it can go in here. One. It can go in here. Two. It can go in here. Three. It can go in one. Two. Ooh, that last one. Three, four, five, and last of all, six. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine. Places where you can put your card in this. It's great. This isn't only for just cards. I find that you can put cash in here too. Not necessarily coins, but definitely notes. And I'll show you how to do that. So um, let me prop him up there. If that will work. No, I don't want to. Okay, no problem. Um, yeah, we'll just leave him there. Okay. Alright, so I'm going to show you my method. So here I have... A $50 note this is an Australian $50 note what I need to do is I need to fold it three times I need to fold it once in half or twice actually once in half nicely in half and then again and then once I do it again I can get my organizer and I can put it into here as you can see, it fits quite snug. Now, obviously, I could put it, um, I think when I first got it, I put it in here. You can fold it in uh, as well. I'll show you. Uh, you can fold it in just one half if you want. And um, it will kind of slip into there. Uh, but I find the best way to do it is to fold it twice, like so. And you can either put it under there. You can put it anywhere. I mean, even if you really wanted to, I wouldn't like to, but you could put it in the back. I'll show you what that back is really useful for. But it's really up to you. It's personal preference. Okay. So, uh, yeah, so I'll show you what the best place for this is. The best place for this is an RFID card. So a PayPass card, an Opal card, um, a door badge card, you know, one that you badge on the door. You tap, you can tap the back here. You can tap that. Uh, you know, I think that would be great. So, uh, for example, I'll show you my Opal card. 
I like to put my Opal card in there whenever I'm catching buses, which is rather rarely, but sometimes I catch buses and I put um, my Opal card in there. And it's great because I can just go up to the reader and just and just go bling. It's great. So, uh, but what I have to find, what I find is that you have to have some cash in this back part here or a card or something in that back part. There are RFID blocking cards. I do recommend getting one if you regularly use this because sometimes tapping this uh, doesn't work. Just sometimes it doesn't work. Sometimes it plays up and doesn't work. I don't know why it just happens. It's Louis Vuitton. <laughs> what do you expect? Practicality? No. Uh, no, it's great. It really is. It's great stuff. So uh, I'll show you. So I put my opal in the back here. There. On the inside, I'll put um, my card there. See my opal card there, uh, and I'll have I have two cards. Normally an opal card, um, and uh, sorry, normally my door badge card, um, an opal card, uh, and normally my ID. Uh, and then just for example, because my ID had my name on it, I didn't want to put that on here. But you could take, for example, this is just an Office Works card. But you could put that into, sometimes I put, like to put cards in the slot there or generally in here. It's great. Great to just slip them into there. It's great. Absolutely great. Um, and then, yeah, but like I said, generally I like to put cash, um, you know, in, into this little part here, into there. So it can go in there. Um, it can obviously go in there as well. You know, it's really, it's personal preference. It's all up to you. It's your you know, it's yours. You know, you can make it yours by organizing it the way that you like. Okay, so it's completely up to you, but definitely this one I would recommend. Uh, as you saw in the receipt, it's 400 Australian dollars. Um, it's so worth it. It is so worth it. Honestly, it's a great little small leather goods piece. As you can see, everything about it is just great. Uh, I would definitely recommend this product, um, and I'll leave a link in the description to this one. Um, and you know, I reckon you should check it out. Even if you just look at it in store, um, it's really worth it. Honestly, it is so worth it. So check it out guys. Thank you very much for watching and I hope you have a great day or night or afternoon or morning, whatever time you're watching this. Leave a comment, subscribe and like. Thank you very much. Goodbye.